بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على سيدنا محمد أشرف المرسلين أبناء الأحباء طلبة كلية طب الأسنان جامعة الأنطرة معاكم الأستاذة الدكتورة إيمان عبد السلام شكل هيد أوف ريموفال بروستودونتيك أبناء الطلبة كلينيكال ريموفال بروستودونتيك تو ناو وي أر ديسكاس جو ريليشن ريكورد فور ريموفال بارشال دينشر Removable jaw relation for removable partial denture. Now we are establish a functional and harmonious occlusion is important is the treatment of a denture. So we are seeing here the door of the occlusion. See, it is complete or the partial denture is important to us to achieve the function that we need. Now here there is a picture of the partial denture being removed and the occlusion being removed. Occlusal harmony between a partial denture and remaining natural teeth is a major factor in preservation of the health of their supporting structure. أهمية الأكلوزال والأكلوجن هنا يكون في harmony يعني فيش قصة interference أهميته على remaining natural teeth اللي موجودة وعلى preservation of health. Ian Hart also. The goal in developing an occlusal scheme for the removal of partial denture, the head of when we are doing an occlusal scheme for removal of partial denture, is to provide masticatory efficiency and aesthetically acceptable, and to distribute the occlusal loading as evenly as possible to all supporting structure. In case of removable partial denture. Relation record. We see here some pictures to demonstrate the. When the partial denture is opposing complete denture, or only anterior teeth remain on both arches, like in this. In this situation, jaw relation records and the arrangement of the teeth may proceed. In the same manner as with complete denture, and the same general principle will be applied. When all other types of partial denture, the remaining teeth dictate the occlusion. Like this case, the dentist should strive for plain contact in central occlusion and no interference in lateral exclusion. The establishment of a satisfactory occlusion for the partial denture patient should include analysis of the existing occlusion, number two, correction of the existing occlusal disharmony, number three, recording of centric relation and adjustment centric occlusion. As we see. Number four, the recording of eccentric jaw relation or functional eccentric occlusion, the correction of occlusal discrepancies created by the pit of a framework and improving. Desirable occlusal contact relationship for the removable partial denture. Number one. Simultaneous bilateral contact of the opposing posterior teeth must occur in centric. Occlusion for two supported removable partial denture may be arranged similar to the occlusion seen in a harmony of a natural dentition. Here, in cases of the bounded class three bounded saddle, we see. Bilateral simultaneous contact of the posterior teeth in central occlusion, and the occlusion of the two supported a rigid similar occlusion in harmony dentin. Bilateral balance occlusion in eccentric position should be formulated when a maxillary complete denture or both the removable partial denture. This is to promote the stability of the complete denture. Here, like in case of single denture. We must do balanced bilateral balanced occlusion in eccentric position. Should be formulated when maxillary complete denture or both two removable partial denture. This is to promote the stability of the complete denture.
a working side contact should be obtained for the mandibular distal extension. This contact should occur simultaneously with the working side contact of the natural teeth to distribute the stress over the greatest possible. Number five, simultaneously working and balancing contact should be formulated for the maxillary bilateral distal extension removable partial denture whenever possible. Only working side contact need to be formulated to either maxillary or mandibular unilite distal extension removal partial denture. This is can be applied for a single denture opposing the two class 1 or class 2 distal extension as we see. In Kennedy class, four removable partial dentures should contact the opposing anterior natural teeth in planed intercuspal position to prevent a continuous eruption of the opposing natural incisor unless they are otherwise prevented from extrusion by means of a lingual plate auxiliary par or by splinting, as we see here in class 4. Artificial posterior teeth shouldn't be arranged further distally than the beginning of a sharp upward incline of the mandibular residual ridge or over the retromolar bed. As we see here in the setting of the teeth on the Occlusal relationship may be established by the use of the most appropriate of the following missiles to fit a particular partial interest. Now we do examples for the different classes, class 1, 2, 3, 4, and the opposing, opposing arch may be uh, partially identical or completely identical as in case of single denture. Uh, here, these are the different methods for establishing or resisting the jaw relation. The first one is direct abposition of the cast. Second, interocclusal records with posterior teeth remaining. Third, occlusal relation using occlusion rim in record basis. Jaw relation record made entirely on occlusion rim, establishing occlusion. The first one, direct opposition of the cast, this method is used when there are sufficient opposing teeth that remain in contact to make the existing jaw relation obvious. ودي أسهل الطرق للحالات اللي هي missing one أو two لكن remaining teeth بنقدر نعمل بعد ما بنصب الإمبريشن نبدأ نعمل opposition للقاست ويبقى في كونتاكت ودي بيبقى من وان امبريشن من وان برايمري امبريشن للفلاسكينج والفينشينج والبولشينج لايك ذيس كيس وين اونلي ا فيو تيز ار تو بي ريبليس فور ا شورت دنشر بيزز اند ذير از نو ايفيدنس اوف اوكلوزال باثولوجي لايك ذيس كيس ان ذيس ميثود اوبوزينج كاست مي بي اوكلودد باي هاند the occluded cast should be held in a position with rigid supports attached with a sticky wax to the basis of the cast until they are securely mounted on articulator. Face bow is not indicated. No need for face bow. The second technique interocclusal records with posterior teeth remaining. Second method, which is a modification of the first, is used when sufficient teeth remain to support the partial denture, Kennedy class 3 or Kennedy class 4, or relation of the opposing teeth does not permit the occluding cast by the hand. In such a situation, jaw relation must be established the same as for fixed restoration that use some type of interoculus. 
like the wax record, اللي هو بنسميه الوax wafer, cheap pipe wax wafer, will be influenced by the bulk and the consistency of the wax and the accuracy of the wax after chilling. بعد ما بنبرده, exist wax that contact the mucosal surface may distort the soft tissue, thereby preventing accurate seating of the wax record on the stone cap. Wax record. Distortion of the wax during or after removal from the mouth may also interfere with accurate sitting. يعني هنا عندنا الأكلوزال wax وآدي العيوب ممكن تبقى إيه. Zinc oxide and eugenol in pressure test. An interocclusal record may also be made with this material. The advantage of the zinc oxide over the wax as recording medium for the occlusal record. Uniformity of consistency, easy of treatment on closure. Accuracy of the accusal surface reproduction, dimensional stability, the possibility of some modification in the occlusal relationship after closure. It is made before the material sets. Less likelihood of distortion during mount. And then now I tell it, the pipe train, ready-made pipe train may be used. The final one, the one that is the cheap pipe wax wafer, wax. The one that is made with zinc oxide. The one that I tell it, the pipe train, train. Ready-made pipe train may be used to record the jaw relation. The final recording material is placed on both sides of the train, and the patient is guided to close in. Now this is the train. Three important to be observed when when use such a material as a follow. Make sure that the occlusion is satisfactory before making the interocclusal record. Be sure that the cast are accurate reproduction of the teeth being recorded. Trim the record with a sharp knife wherever it engages undercut soft tissue or. لازم ناخد بالنا من الطريقة الأخيرة اللي هي بالباي تري. Now, the third method, occlusal relation using occlusal rim on record basis. This is the third method that is used when one or more distal extension areas or long bounded areas are present. Like we see. By the aid of the occlusal occlusion rim, supported by record basis to substitute for the missing teeth, jaw relation established in the following order. One of the record blocks is now inserted and the occlusal plane trimmed to the correct level. The other block is then inserted and adjusted until a similar condition can be obtained. Phase four transfer can be taken. In a number of cases, it will be found possible to obtain an accurate recording by the use only one block. Whenever this is possible, it should be done. When two blocks are being used, they should be trimmed to allow complete closure without any pressure being applied to them. Like we see the pictures. The relationship of natural teeth to each other must be inspected. If they are further apart on the cast, then they are in the mouth. Compression of the wax on mucosa must be suspected. Final recording of the tooth position can be secured. By placing thin layer of pipe registration paste over the occlusal surface of one, هنا بعد ما بنحط الوax ونلاقي الأكلوجن بتاع الناتشورال تيس مضبوطين بقفل الأكلوجن على الريكورد بلوك بإن أنا أحط إيه thin layer من الباست على البايت بلوك والأكلوجن سيرفيس of one blocks and having the patient to close إن هما يقفلهم عليهم this serves to equalize the pressure throughout
your relation record made entirely on occlusion rib. This is done in cases where no occlusion contact exists between the remaining natural teeth, such as when one jaw is a dentulous and the other is to be restored by the partial denture, as in case of single denture in the upper and the bilateral uh, class 1 in the lower distal extension bases. In case of the remaining teeth, do not occlude and will not influence eccentric jaw movements. In case when both arch have only anterior teeth present, and I now have the استخدمها في الحالات ديت تبقى الجو ريليشن انتاجي على الأكلوزن ريم. Clinical procedure: either the upper or the lower record block is tried alternatively in the mouth and tested for fit. بنعمل بروفا لكل ريكورد بلوك الابر على حدة واللور على حدة ونشوف الريتنشن والاكستنشن والاستابيليتي والبروبر فيشر كونتور والاكلوزا البلين الالايند مع التريمينج الواكس ريم لللور ريكورد بلوك للليفل انديكيتد انتيري باي ذا ابارتمنت تيز بالسيريور بالبيز اوف ذا ريتروم يبقى تو سيرد اوف ذا ريتروم مولار يعني بنعمل ادجستمنت للريكورد بلوك الابر واللور كل على حدة بعد كده الاكلوجن between the upper and the lower record block is adjusted so that occlusal plane is aligned correctly. Face for transfer to mount the upper cast. ببدأ أنا بعد ما ظبط الأبر واللور مع بعضيهم ببدأ أخذ face for وأن ال cast mounting على الأشكالات. The vertical dimension is determined by registering a rest position the record block out of the mouth. The rest position obtained by asking a patient to see. M, say M, and measuring a distance. They will start to name it deep dentition. The patient is then asked to close with the record block in the mouth. If same measurements were recorded, then two to three millimeter is removed from the upper rim to obtain vertical dimension of occlusion. Left side, we name it the complete dentition. Left side, the same. Increasing this vertical occlusal vertical dimension. Should occur only if the patient displays symptoms that suggested that the vertical dimension of occlusion has dimension such as tired, uh, aching muscle, unexplained pain in the head and the neck, appearance of premature aging caused by shortening in nose or chin. We are going to do the vertical dimension a little bit in the three cases that we mentioned. وفي اكسسيف فري واي في الحالات دي ازود شويه في الفيرتيكال دايمنشن اكستريم انتيريور فيرتيكال اوفرلاب ان ويتش ذا مانديبولار تيس اكشوالي استريك ذا سوفت تيشو اوف ذا بالانس برضه في الحالات اللي احنا شايفينها بضطر ان انا ارفع شويه وعندنا الصوره كلينيكالي باينه ازاي بضطر ان انا ارفع شويه الاوفر بايت الفيرتيكال اوفرلاب الفيرتيكال دايمنشن عشان يرفع لي شويه ال في حالة المايجريشن أو the condyles as seen in radiographs. أنا بعمل radiographs ولا إذا في مايجريشنز في الكوندايل أزود برضو اللي هي بنسميها bite raised ablands. أنا أرفع closer stent في مشاكل في التي. If these signs and symptoms are present, a temporary increase in the existing vertical dimension can be considered with a temporary removable appliance in the form. Of an acrylic ridden occlusal overlay to cover the maxillary teeth. That will result in many all partial occlusal overlay. دي الحالات اللي إحنا بنرفع فيها vertical dimension شوية في الحالات الخمسة أو الستة الصب. When permanent treatment begins, it must be planned so that all occlusal dimension restoring processes, fixed and removable, are inserted at the Example of increased vertical dimension. You see here some pictures. Here we see there is some increase to solve the problem in the uh, previous six statement. Six حالات سابقين أو الخمس حالات سابقين هنا واضح إن بالصورة إزاي بنرفع vertical dimension شوي.
horizontal jaw relationship, two horizontal jaw relationship of man with the boy two macrocellular are of important in the occlusion of uh, removable partial denture. Here and then a centric relation of the centric occlusion. In more than 90% of all people, centric relation with centric occlusion doesn't coincide. Same for me, I many nests, the two does not coincide with that only on the channel poor density. The model of occlusion, I'm going to show inshallah. Centric occlusion will always be anterior to the centric relation 1 to 2 mm. The patient with partial denture will always function in these two positions. So, deflective occlusal contact in either position must be avoided. In the marid, I have a slide in the center slide in centric and fine centric, which is the maximum intercourse patient with the center of the center of the وفي السلايد ان سنتريك اللي هما 90% الناس بيبقى عندهم سلايد ان سنتريك نتيجه للبور دينسري لكن بوينت سنتريك 90% اللي هما بيبقاش عندهم السنتريك ريليشن والسنتريك اوكلوجن ما بيبقوش كوانسايد مع بعض خدتوا بالكم فبنتنقل لحاجه اسمها السلايد ان سنتريك اللي هما 90% من الناس عندهم طبيعه الاوكلوجن ديت بعد كده في الفري اوكلوجن اللي احنا بنبدا نظبطها نتيجه للكوزما الانترفيرنس بالسلكتيف جراني ديفليكتيف اوكلوزال كونتاكت از ذا كونتاكت ذا ديسبليس تو اس دايركت ذا ماندبل فروم اتس انتندد موفمنت اور ديسبلي دي ريموفابل دينشر فروم ات ويتش تو سلكت سنتريك ريليشن او سنتريك اوكلوجن ان ريكوردينج الهوريزونتال جو ريليشن is a centric relation with occlusion coincide fabricate the restoration in centric relation is a letnin amlin coincide ma ba ashtaghal fiha fi centric relation wa ahna arfin ma'na centric relation al hiya al most retroded relation in mandible we in maxilla lam al condyle fi most unstrained position at any degree of jaw separation al huwa ma'na centric relation if the centric relation with centric occlusion do not coincide, but the brain centric occlusion position is really obvious, fabricate in centric occlusion. يعني على حالة بين الحالتين. الحالة الثالثة اللي هي centric relation with brain centric occlusion position do not coincide, will enter cusper position is not clear. يعني الاثنين اللي هما coincide مع بعضهم ولا centric the inter cusper position هو centric occlusion. ولا السنتريك اوكلوجن بتاعنا كليرلي اوبجيس في الحاله ديت انا بعمل الفابريكيشن بتاعتي ان اذا البوستيريور تيز ار نوت بريزنت ان ون اور بوت ارشز ذا دينشر ويل بي فابريكيتد ان سنتريك دينشر بتاعنا بالظبط سيلينج ذا ريكورد بلوكس توجذر از بيست دان باي بليسينج ا فيري ثين لاير اوف سوفت واكس نبدا بعد ما بنعمل ريكورد بالفيرتيكال دايمنشن صح والسنتريك اوكلوجن او ريليشن صح ابدا اعمل سيلينج لتو ريكورد بلوكس بالسوفت واكس او بالزنك اوكسيد باست اوفر ذا اوكلوزال سيرفيس اوف ذا ابر ريكورد بلوك بيفور اسكن ذا بيشن تو كلوز فاينلي ذا ناتشرال تي اس ويل ميك ايدنتيشن اون ذا اوكلوزال سيرفيس اوف ذا تو بلوك ويل بي يونيتد ذا سنترال لاين والهاي ليب لاين ماست بي ماركد اون ذا ابر ريكورد Mounting lower models using horizontal jaw relation, registration of eccentric relation value. Establishing occlusion by recording in occlusal pathway. The fifth method of establishing occlusion in the partial denture is registration of the occlusal pathway and the use of an occluding template rather than a cast of the opposing arches, the functionally generated bus, the dynamic missile, as we see in the pictures. This is based on the theory that the patient himself is the best articulator for developing occlusion. The technique consists of having the patient create in wax his own individual pattern of jaw movement. The pattern which he creates in the wax is a negative record movement through the space of each opposing tooth. 
at the mandible perform in its execution. يبقى هو ال dynamic method هو ال identifications movement بتاعة السنان على الوكس wax هي اللي بتبين لنا ال movement بتاع ال mandible في ال function excursive movement زي ما احنا شايفينها في الصور. There are two methods having the patient grind the occlusal pathway. The first method, the patients make the framework with the denture bead and the occlusal rim, attach it home to wear it con continuously for 24 hours, except when eating and when drinking hot or chilled drinks. The value of the patients wearing the denture will, while sleeping, is that in voluntary or paroxysmic contact will be recorded as the resulted pathway will be recorded of all possible jaw movement and tooth contact, when though some of contact may be undesirable. The completed wax pattern will resemble a slight larger version, buccal of the teeth that originally occupied by the teeth. As we see, the wax pattern in boxes and food in improved dental stone to provide permanent record of the generated past. The stone recorded is mounted on the artwork. Here, قصة كلها إن هو عايز يعمل generated path technique index law بإنه بينحط wax على occlusal surface في الفرشر اللي هو لبسه على metal framework. والبيشنز ممكن يعمل excursive movement أو إن هو ممكن بيلبسه في البيت الباراباكشنال هابس اللي بيعملها والexcursive movement اللي بتتعمل بناخد ال identification دي ونصب فيها واكس يبقى عندي مودلز من السنان بالستون تيس خدت بالكم وأبدأ أنا أعمل mounting لها على ال articulator وأصلح ال The second method, the patient is creating the pathway in the dental office directly under the supervision of the dentist. Our noy amilha fi the clinic under the doctor. Advantage of this method, the dentist being able to observe and correct the movement of the patient making. Taban la miamila fi the clinic, the dentist ay dar misado u cooperate him. This advantage of this method normally a patient will require at least 30 minutes. The patient needs to have a minimum of 30 minutes of active movement to complete. The patient needs to have a minimum of 30 minutes of active movement to complete. The patient needs to have a minimum of 30 minutes of active movement to complete. These generated pathways are then reproduced in stone. As we have seen, we are going to start to put it in vibrating stone in the identification of the wax. وأبدأ أطلعها في الستون so that each groove in the wax. إن أنا أعمل إيه في ال wax identification أعمل أصب vibrating الستون فيها وأبدأ أطلع positive reports لها. Representing the pathway of a cusp becomes a ridge in the stone. زي ما إحنا شايفينه اللي هنا الستون cusp اللي موجود وفي ال identifications بتاعتنا دي الستون. The artificial teeth are then arranged on the partial denture framework to the intercuspal with the pathway of their antagonist as represented by these stone edges. After I arrange the sinan, the artificial, with the identifications that are present in the stone cusp. Advantages of functionally generated path method. Jaw movement and the tooth pathway are reproduced under more nearly functional condition than is the case when static registration intraoral records are transferred to an instrument. Functionally generated method doesn't relay for its accuracy and effectiveness on the type of the complexity of the collision. The method also eliminates the need for tracing a device or for phase for transit. ودي موجودة في الموضوع السنجل دنشر آه اللي هو لا لسه هتاخدوه السنة الجاية إن شاء الله اللي هو فانكشن جينيريتد باس تكنيك هيعاد التكنيكس بتاع الجوريليشن ريكورد في السنجل أبر دنشر أوبوز للكلاس 1 ديستال إكستنشن ريموفابل. Limitations of the functionally generated path method. Patient the masticatory force and the direction. may vary with foods of different types and textures. 
difficult to develop occlusion for the partial denture of potently complete denture اللي هي حالات السنجل denture في الأبر Movement of the distal extension basis carrying dream is possible. This is not indicated whether the process is to replace the anterior function generated past and leave a few replacing the anterior disc that are indicated to the system. Some of the methods described previously may be applied to the construction of the partial denture in both arches simultaneously, whereas the registration of the occlusal pathway requires that an opposing arch be intact or restored to the extent of land treatment. Factor influencing the development of occlusion Inclination of the condylar guidance, the permanence home hamsa factors, the condylar guidance, compensating curve, the inclination of the occlusal orientation, Inclination of the incisal guidance, real incisal guidance, and the height of the cusp. The presence of some natural teeth means that the prominence of the compensating curve has been determined and the plane of orientation is present. The presence of the anterior teeth means that the incisal guidance is determined and the height of the cusp is known. طبعا الحالات ديت برضو احنا بنحتاجها في حالة الكومبليت دنشر ولكن في البارشال دنشر لان في بعض اسنان بتبقى موجودة فبتختلف شوية. This means that in partial denture construction the remaining natural teeth will dictate the form and position of the artificial teeth. يعني هنا حالة البارشال دنشر هنلاقي وجود remaining natural teeth هما اللي بيحددوا لنا الشكل والبوزيشن بتاع الارتفيشال مش زي الكومبليت دنشر. The only exception are when the removal partial denture opposed by complete denture. هنا بنبدأ إنه نشتغل فيه كcomplete denture. When only anterior teeth remain in both arches and the incisor relationship is not interfering. لما يبقى عندي ال anterior هي اللي موجودة في البوست وال incisor relationship ما بتدخلش في مشكلة بتاعتها. هنا دي guidelines في الأكلوجن في البارشال إدنشرس بارشال أكلوزر كونسبت ده بس للمعرفة ولكنكم غير مطالبين به لأن أنتم لسه ما درستوش الأكلوجن ولكن هي معلومة تبدأوا أنتم تعرفوا أنا هعمل أكلوجن فين Finally complete denture always have been a really Organized occlusion, partial denture usually have a confirmative occlusion. A reorganized approach for the partial denture may be considered to correct an overclosed occlusion, improve the occlusion, for example, when there is a gross discrepancy between the centric position and the intercus. Finally, I wanted to thank you for uh, listening my lectures in voice record. أه بروفيسور إيمان عبد السلام شكل أستاذ ورئيس قسم الاستعاضة بجامعة الأنطرة أشكركم and I am waiting for any questions and feel free to contact me in any time هذه المحاضرة بلاس الهاند أوت اللي معاكم تقدروا تسا... تساعدكم والجدول اللي فيه الأكلوجن على فكرة هو ممكن يكون ملخص لكم عن نص السلايدز الأولانية اللي أنا بتكلم فيها في حالة الأكلوجن في كلاس 1 يبقى نوع الأوكلوجن إيه والقصة دي هو ممكن يساعدكم لأن هيتشرح بالتفصيل بعد كده إن شاء الله كان أنا عمر السنة الجاية بإذن الله أشكركم والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته